Hey everyone, welcome to Avid Max Tying Tuesdays. Today we're going to show you a nice little midge pattern, very simple pattern. This is the tube midge. So it starts on a very, uh, very popular hook. This is the Daiichi 1130. It's a scud style emerger uh, variation hook. We're going to use our Vivas thread in red color. And then we're going to use a little bit of tubing. The tube midge is the midge tubing in red. And then finally, we're going to finish off with a countersunk tungsten bead. And this is the 564 size for the size 18 that we're tying today. So this is a great basic pattern. Um, it's also very handy to have in your box all through the winter months here in Colorado or anywhere else you have the opportunity to get out on some tailwater fisheries. Uh, you can uh, whip out some of these tube midges in a bunch of different colors and be ready to go for a bunch of different situations as well. So I'm just gonna start my red thread on there, that 16 knot thread. And then we're gonna come in with our only other material here besides the bead and the thread, which is our midge tubing. And we're just gonna lock it in right on the side of the hook shank here. Just like so, pull it back so that it's flush, don't have to trim it. And then I'll pull tight as I work my way back down the body of the fly here, just nice and even down through the hook bend, just a little bit down give kind of a curved profile to this midge pattern. And then we take our thread back up, avoiding the hook point there. Just like so. Real simple, real easy. This is a fly that you're gonna wanna fish deep uh, as a, a midge pupa. And then we're just gonna come with our midge tubing and do close touching wraps. Nice and snug all the way up to the front to where the bead is. And then we capture it. And tie it off here. So I like doing them in red. Uh, I know a lot of people do white, black, olive. Another fun way you can, you can play around with these tube colors is if you get the clear and then just do some variations of thread colors underneath and it kind of gives you that translucent body, the exoskeleton that you might see on a lot of your different bugs out there. So just down and dirty, quick little tube midge. Thanks for watching. Be sure to give us a thumbs up and share this video with your friends. If you have a fly you'd like to see us tie in the future, leave us a comment below. For more fly fishing and outdoor related videos, subscribe to the Avid Max YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and we'll see you out there.